Hello friends, Dennis here and welcome back to the den. I have done a little bit of work here. Uh, if we take a little bit of a look here, you can see we have gotten quite some drops. I have emptied this out and made some rockets. And, um, excuse me. And I've also made a new, um, skin for my, uh, uh camera account. So it's, uh, we're, we're a little bit the same, but different. I think that's a bit better. Uh, the eyes still need a little bit of work, but that's okay. Uh, but yeah, I, I think that's kind of cool. Um, having... Having them be pretty similar, but being different, I think that's a good, uh, good thing when it comes to, um, secondary accounts and that. And he's been shot. They, they don't fall down here, so I'm gonna have to redo this, but, uh, so I just threw up a little bit of that because I want to do some more work in this area today. And what I'm thinking is we're gonna do a little bit of work over here I have flattened out a little bit of an area here because what I'm thinking uh, is that I want to go in bring a little bit of these this is about the middle I'm guessing uh, so what I want to do is basically go right here and build something that goes maybe this tall I'm, I'm not really sure about the height of it but uh, what I do know is that we're gonna... Th this is basically gonna be a trader's village hall. So I want to have villager there, villager there. And yeah, it, it that is actually the height I need. Okay, that's good. That's good to know. Um, no, I'm not gonna be using oak logs for the whole thing, but... Uh, it could have been nice to just... Um, uh, kind of do a little bit of work on it and just kind of show you what I'm uh, envisioning, basically. Uh, so if we go something like this, and then maybe we could go here and... Doot, doot, doot. Is, is that right? Ah, uh, we're gonna say it's right. And then we can kind of go... So, so all of the logs going upwards, they are going to be the wall, and all of these uh, horizontal lines are going to be... Or is that vertical? I never remember those two. Uh, but basically, upwards is uh, the wall, sideways is where I'm going to want the uh, villagers. And this is not the material I want to use, just FYI. I'm just trying to show you guys my uh, envision, my plan a little bit. Uh, so if we go, I think, okay, so if we have two, one, two, three, four, five, like so, and then this wall can kind of go in, you know, uh, maybe we could go with one more right here, just, just for a good measurement. Uh, and then we can go like that, and uh, that will basically be one side of the villager trading hall, or wall. This is basically gonna be a wall, and maybe I need to move it a little bit for, uh, forward, because I'm going to want to have uh, kind of a plateau on top of uh, the first row, so the plateau on top of that, or the um, roof for the uh, villager, is where the next layer of villagers are gonna be. Uh, and I'm thinking that the first row is basically gonna be farmers, and then we can have librarians up top. That That's basically what I'm thinking. Um, or uh, farm... Uh, say we have four farmers here, right? Four farmers we can trade with. I think that's the amount we have right now. Um, so, farmer, 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 farmer. And then something else right there, maybe a blacksmith or uh, some sort of weapon smith or something. So we can easily get some good stuffs back. And then here, on this side, we can have uh, weapon smiths. No, um, yeah, no, uh, tool smiths. Uh, to easily get access to our different types of um, tools that we're going to be wanting. Uh, so I think that's going to be it. 
Okay, we are back, and I have been doing a little bit of work, and uh, one side is this one. I, I made two different types of walls, so they would basically be like um, this one. A little bit of random leaves around, and uh, that kind of good stuff. Uh, red nether wart brick in the background, and uh, then we would have the uh, villager themselves be right there. Like, I, I can't actually properly show but I were kind of considering to have a jukebox right there but I think that it may be too expensive for us because we don't have a lot of diamonds and these uh, these are wooden diamond uh, so I'm not sure if I can really um, afford it and we can't use a note block because I have changed uh, the texture for it, I, we, we could use this, but it, it doesn't give the same feeling as a jukebox does in that sense. Um, actually, it could kind of work, kind of. Um, so I'm, I'm leaning towards this one, and in the corner here we can have uh, staircases going up, so we can easily access the second floor as well, although it will make it a bit weird with this part right here. Uh, the second design that I'm kind of considering is this one. Uh, here uh, it would be pretty open. Uh, I would probably add a little bit of maybe something like this um, in between, but uh, uh, so we can like easily access and at the same time kind of uh, protect the villagers. Maybe we will actually just do something like this. Um, because I want to be able to easily access them without having to worry about uh, zombie babies reaching them, basically. But I mean, I, lo I love this one. I, I love this. It's a little impractical, but I guess we could kind of change out the leaves on top of here and kind of having leaves coming from the back and over, if that makes any sense. Uh, and also having some leaves on this side and making the staircase a little bit more interesting because it's going to be flat. So I think, I think I prefer this design. Maybe it's a too, maybe it's too much going on. Uh, but it's a whole lot better than this one, which is really boring, to be honest. We're not episode four anymore, you know? <laughs> Uh, we, we should have access to be doing this, uh, honestly, we should, have had a, we should have had a lot more diamonds than what we got. So that's, uh, that's one of the downfalls of the, my world. But I think I'm gonna basically build this design right here because I really do love it. Uh, I hope you guys uh, agree. I can't really come up with a different type of design at the moment. Um... Because we are very... Uh, we don't have access to all the blocks. If we had more block access, I would probably consider doing something different. But this is what we can do. So I'm going to start collecting some um, clay and start melting it down. And we will be back in just a second. Okay, we are back. I have been grinding away. I have repaired my tools and... Uh, we have a new tool as well. Oh, look at that. We have a new tool, an iron shovel, because I didn't want to spend any more diamonds and I wanted a... Uh, I wanted a fortune shovel, basically, to better get bricks. And it worked. Uh, so what we need to do now is to start the build itself. So I think we're just gonna slowly replace the stuffs and I can't remember if it I, I think it was too in the test world as well so if we first do the first cell uh, I think that will do us a little bit good yeah I think that was correct and then we're gonna go what there yeah because that'll give us a cell on the top as well but I think we need to pull this one forward one and then we can have that one on that level so we're gonna go like this and just gently bring it forward 
like so. And then we can go in the back right here and just take this part down. And that should be one cell, right? Uh, and then we're gonna go right here and do the same thing. Uh, so we're gonna go up to there. And we're gonna go up to there. And then in the back here, we're gonna go one up like so. Not like so, because I fell down. Uh, then we're gonna go like so. Right? I think so. So we need to take that one down and we need to place that one right there. And there we go. And then what we can do right in the middle here is to basically go with uh, oak logs and lift it up like so. Right? I think that could be good. Like so. And, oh, I fell all the way down. And it's nighttime, so mobs are going to be spawning. But a little bit of difference in what I was thinking. And I think that is alright to do. And then maybe we could go in, in the third one right here. And kind of lift it. Let's see, we need some more wood. And lift it up right here. So that we can go like... Can I please? Thank you. So we can go like that. I think that would be much better. I think. Uh, so let us get this all the way up. There we go. And take a look at that. I think it'll work. It's a little bit different from what I originally had planned, but it's better, in my opinion. It's it's a lot better. Uh, so I'm gonna keep working here. Can I please? There we go. Okay, so I'm just gonna keep working, and we will be back in just a second. Okay, we are back real quick, because I have started to uh, do some experimentation here. Um, I've got that cell almost ready, and two more on the edge right here. But we are missing one vital thing, and that is a lighting that I really want to have here. Uh, so what we need to do... Because I failed it last time I were in the end. We need, we need to go to the end, and we need to gather up some... What, what's it called again? Uh, well, uh, I, I don't remember, but it's, uh, it's, it's this fruit that we're go going to need. Um, we need the stem of that fruit. Oh, I didn't even realize. I forgot that I had clay here. <laughs> um... But yeah, we, we need to go to the end and gather up a couple of that so we can do, so we can use that as a lighting source. Because I feel like that would make a bit sense. Uh, so I'm thinking I, I just want to bring you guys uh, along a little bit because I'm building so much in between the clips. And uh, I, I would like to talk a little bit about... Um, I found this uh, podcast uh, the other day, for me the other day, and uh, it's uh, it's about psychology and that kind of good stuff, <laughs> good stuff. Uh, but uh, it's it it's really kind of making me think a bit, and it, it's it's great. Um, it, it's great thinking. It, it's nothing negative in that direction, but um, it, it kind of teaches me a little bit. Oh, I forgot to bring Ender Pearls. Ah, we can easily get some. No problem. Uh, I think also there might be some right over here if they haven't despawned. I'm guessing they have despawned. Yeah, they, they, uh, those have despawned, but that's okay. Because we can just get underneath here. And get a couple of them to get over here, and we can just. Boop, 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 boop. 
Although they are teleporting everywhere. Uh, can you guys please die soon? There we go, that's one. There we go, that's another. There we go. Is there anyone else after me? I don't think so. Okay, good. Okay. Uh, but I am going to uh, go ahead, do a little bit of uh, that fruit uh, mining, and uh, we will be back when I have um, built some more. Um, because I uh, I went suddenly silent there for a second because I just started to think even more about the uh, um, the podcast. Uh, if you know of any in your language, uh, because the one I'm listening to is in my language, I'm guessing you wouldn't really understand a lot about it. Um, but I, I would definitely recommend you go ahead and listen to something like that and. Maybe it'll, maybe it'll give you a little bit of insight to something that you hadn't really thought of before, you know? So I would, uh, I would recommend some uh, something like that. Uh, I felt that it was great to have a little bit of a break from only having Minecraft podcasts and uh, a Minecraft series to watch. Because I usually just watch Minecraft stuff. Um, not always the best idea. To just have that but uh, let's see we're gonna go ahead and gather a few of these let's see can I land on you oh perfect oh that they're, they're mad okay not really a big fan of that but we need a few of these to kind of be able to grow these um, so I'm gonna go ahead do a little bit of this and we will be back in just a second okay we are back back. Uh, this is gonna be a really short clip because I... the, the, the time, you know. Um, so I came across a um, uh, end city on the way back and I got myself a new elytras. That is amazing. I want to put it up. I want to have it on a armor stand and I don't want to lose it. Uh, there we go, and then we need some sticks, so we need to just go like so. Then we're gonna be able to make this guy. Boop. And we can place him right there. Why not? And then we can go there. And to make sure that we don't lose our old gear, because um, we got some new and better stuff. Protection, protection uh, like protection 4, protection 4. And uh, Feather Falling 4, we had 3, so I'm more protected when I fall. So th that, that, was, that was a great one. We have some more Shulker Shells as well, so that is amazing. Um, we can pick those back up, and we can just throw them in there. The same with those, and we got some good loot as well. That one goes in here, actually. And the Protection 4 chest plate we can place right there. There we go. Okay, good. That's awesome. Uh, now what we can do is go in here and fetch these guys. And that should give us a new recipe. Which we can't craft, but uh, it, it, it gives us a new recipe. Uh, and rod. So we need blaze rods. Okay, that's not a big deal. We have some. We got a couple of them. Uh, meaning that we need to get some more blazes going, but that's okay. So we can go ahead and make us some of these. Let's just make ourselves 12. Oh, we get four. Okay, we can do that, and that'll be good for now. Um, because I, I just want to kind of show you guys the, the, the basic of these uh, cells that I'm making for the villagers who are... Who are Hopefully, gonna have a great time in their uh, cells. Uh, so, if we get up here real quick, we're gonna have these going right up top there. And that is because I wanna make sure that uh, we're not gonna get any zombies spawning in here. So, 
with that part out of the way, uh, oh, I got a potion of healing as well. That's cool. Uh, with that out of the way, we can uh, get back to building, and we will be back with uh, not the final result, but uh, hopefully we will start to get some villagers in here pretty soon. Okay, we are back, and it's actually getting pretty late over here. The time, like it's 12 a.m. I'm not sure why I went into that. But I wanted to just kind of bring you guys in on us getting the first villager in. I think that'll be good. Um, so I'm thinking if we can get him up here. Actually, I'm thinking up here. I think that would be easier. Less turns. <laughs> Uh, but, uh, yeah, if we can get him up here, uh, we could perhaps start filling up, uh, let's see, I kind of forgot where it goes, but we're just gonna go ahead and do this. I've done a little bit of something different here. Uh, I've changed up a little bit of something, and that is these logs. They did not go out earlier, but I think it fits so much better. Um... Also, if we can go eh, uh, on the top here on these logs and just throw up some stairs, maybe maybe that'll help a little bit. Or maybe... Oh, I just thought of this now. What I, why didn't I think of this earlier? If we make a couple of these, um, that would maybe fit a bit better. So we could maybe go... On these, take these down again. Thank you. And maybe we could go like that. Maybe? No. I, I think uh, we need to bring him down there instead. I think that'll be better. Now I'm just testing out. And the... the uh, it's okay to be testing, you know? Uh... I like to test and make sure that everything works fine. And there. But I would have preferred it if we could get those going that way. But that'll kind of ruin it down here. So I think that'll be good. Uh, yeah, I think that'll be bed better. Yeah. Uh, let us go ahead and get these guys going. Let's get uh, our inventory sorted out a little bit. There we go. Thank you. So what I'm thinking is we're going to be using rails again. Uh, except that this time when we use the rails, we, we kind of get rid of the, the carts they're in. Uh, so I'm thinking we can start off with this guy, right? Uh, I think it was right here. Yeah, perfect. Look at that. Uh, meaning that we need to go ahead and fetch ourselves a few rails so that we can get this going. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and grab one stack of these guys. Uh, we can bring these guys, and we need one stack of these guys to begin with. Um, and I kind of forgot that that guy's in a boat. That will make it a bit more challenging, but that's okay. Um, we're gonna start off with those right there, I think. Thank you. And then we're just going to go ahead and bring that one over like so. And bring a couple of those right there. Go ahead and go like these. And these needs a little bit of soap. There and there. I think that should... Yeah, good. Um, meaning that I need to get my hands on a new cart. I don't think we have any more in the breeder. Uh, but this is basically how I'm gonna do it with all of them. I'm realizing that the time is really not on our side right now. Uh, we need to make a new cart because he is um, in a boat. So we need to make him a new cart. That's okay. I, I did a little bit of something with the armor stand. It looks cool. Uh, let's see, let's get rid of a couple of things, let's get our hands on those, and let's make ourselves one cart. 
Thank you. And then we can throw those back in there, and that'll give us a little bit of something. So what we're going to want is to first off turn these rails off. Place that one right there. Get rid of that one, because why would we want that one? Light up, light up, uh, and bring this guy slowly but surely over here. Okay. And then we should be able to get rid of this without harming him. There we go. Oh no, he ran straight past. Come back. No, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. No. You stupid. Mm. Why? Why did you feel like that was a good idea, huh? I'm gonna place a rail right there. This is on you. You're making this more difficult than it needs to be. I didn't bring that. I, I didn't pick it up. <laughs> Uh, I think that I'm gonna go ahead, do get this guy over, and then we can really. You are gonna go. No! Okay, we are bringing another guy because he just doesn't want to. Note to self do not put them in boats <laughs> when you're finished with them. Uh, because they are impossible to deal with. They are... Hmm, frustrating. But, that's okay. Because now, we can go ahead and bring these guys over and uh, at least start this, you know? So if we just go right here... And just bring them over right here... There? Okay. Uh, and then... There? Okay, good. Uh, we need to remove this, and we need to get that one powered, that one powered, and those one powered, and that should be good. As long as, as the zombies don't come. But, he should now be inside, so that is perfect. And then what I want is a fence. Uh, so let us, uh, why not go for this type of fence? There we go. And then I want to fence him in. Can I get over here? Thank you. There we go. And we can go ahead and remove this one. Right? That's not too bad. Got himself a little bit of a safe area and, uh, maybe we can even uh, do one more thing here. Uh, let's see. Do we have any room in here? No, of course we don't. Um, oh, we have one thing we don't really need. There we go. Uh, thank you. Just to try to make him as safe as possible, we're gonna go ahead and do that. <laughs> uh, perfect. That is perfect. Uh, what else do we not need? Oh, we have some of these. That's okay. Uh, and then we can come in and just... Refill those. Perfect. Okay, so that is basically what I'm gonna be doing, and uh, hopefully we will be having these guys all in here. And everything will be fine. Everything will be good. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you enjoyed, you know what to do. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Okay, bye-bye.